Good morning, YouTube. We're out here early this morning. Fog's lifting quite a bit now. It's going to be a sunny day, but right now it's a little overcast. Just got here. Hadn't really done a lot of fishing yet. Fishing with a buzz bait. Going to paddle on around these coves. These points here and get down into some coves. Over in that general direction, that's where I'm going. Try to get over there before the wind gets up too much. But here we are in the middle of the lake. Headed towards the bank on the other side. Fishing with the boat today. Let me go over here and fish. Talk to you later. Thank you. Well, I'm out in the middle for sure now. Going to the other side. Thought I'd stop video this before the sun broke through the fog today. It's pretty out here this morning. Sometimes you just have to stop and take some nature in. Fish will be biting. Hopefully it's not going to get real windy today. But There's some more fishermen way over there. You don't see too many out here. But there are some. Well, we're about as far back in the cove as we can get. This is what it looks like coming out. Very bassy. Fish the crankbait in and a spinnerbait. Now I'm doing a Texas rig coming out. So this is a good place for big bass to hang out. So we're going to do our diligence to get one before we leave today. Wrapping it up for the day. I'll get one more shot of this beautiful lake on the way in. It goes on around that curve there for a while. Back in there is have not been yet. Have to make a day of it to go back in there. I'll probably fish about a half a day today. Probably getting to be about 12 o'clock. Fish hadn't been biting, but on a place like this, fishing is just something to do while you enjoy the beauty. There's the landing back over there. I'll paddle back over there and probably take out and go home. Wind's not up real high today. So, it's been a nice day. Can't go wrong with the 
No Limits Adventure 10-4 Kayak. I like to keep it simple. And with this kayak, you can definitely do it. Hopefully I was going to use that dip net today, but I still got a ways to go. May catch one on the way home. There are a few houses on the lake there. That's a nice one sitting up on the hill there, but you see very few of them. I saw more fishermen out today than I've seen since I've been here. Been coming. But they usually go home about this time of day, so it's thinning out. And it'll pick back up in the afternoon. Take this No Limits propel paddle and paddle on over to the landing. I haven't even explored the other side of the lake yet. Behind those trees there, the lake goes around there and it goes back to the right for probably a mile, a mile and a half. Way back in there. You cross over the a bridge coming in and then you still have to drive for a couple miles to get back in here to put in. Okay, we're back halfway back to the landing. Stopped in the middle of the lake. Get one more shot. Then I'll paddle in. There's the landing right over there. Not far. Probably about half a mile, maybe. Haven't been up toward the dam yet. There's a big bird out in the lake. You can't see him. If I zoom in, maybe you can see him. I don't know. He's way over there. See a lot of wildlife out here. A lot of cranes, eagles. Saw a water moccasin today swimming by. Paid me no attention. He saw me, but he probably just wanted to get out of the way. He's probably 40 feet away. Just swimming by. But it's a great day. Great day to be out on a Friday. Just remember that Jesus is Lord. and He said, no man come to the Father sick to be by me. He's inviting you to come if you haven't already. It'd be a great idea to do that before you leave this earth. You definitely don't want to miss out on his glory. So I invite you to make Jesus your Lord if you hadn't already. Comes a, some file coming by here.